You heard it here first, right here, right now in August 2021. Candies are a better investment than lavender albinos. <laughs> Let's talk about what really everybody gets going about over lavenders, and that is the Dreamsicle. The Dreamsicle is everybody's dream. I love that Justin brought this project to life. I love the name that it was given. I love everything about the Dreamsicle project. Right now, a female Dreamsicle you can pick up for around $23, $2,500 and a male Dreamsicle you can get sub $2,000 right now. And they're very, very cool and I'm not taking anything away from it and I fully intended to go after one myself or I am going after one myself. But let's look at whatever the candy nickname would be of the Dreamsicle project. And if you look right now, Candy Pides on Morph Market, there's a handful of them available. The least expensive one is going to cost you $4,000. So for the same price of entry, whether it be hets, whether it be visuals, the long term, long, long term, big, big gold prize of a project is going to get you a two for one return right now, $4,000 versus at least $2,350. So in that way is why I think candies are a far better investment right now. And I think that they're worth looking for because you can get them at a reasonable price relative to a lavender. Now, those pied, uh, pied candies take a long, long time to get to or a double recessive. Imagine a candy clown or if you were to go down the road of doing a candy snow with an axanthic, oof, or, or. There is, I've got to find, you know what, I'm going to find it. There is a, a triple het with a candy out there that is just phenomenal. Those take a long time. Yes, they will take a long time. And yes, the prices will probably come down and the supply will probably come up in that time. But it will come up relatively the same with uh, lavenders and everything that lavender has going on. So. By the time you get a double uh, recessive visual, maybe you're not getting four grand back for it, but relative to what the prices will have dropped on Dreamsicles by then, I bet candies will be worth a whole lot more then. Keep it right here to find out what I do with my candy and my lavender projects, and I hope to see you all at Daytona. I can't wait to show you some of the cool pickups, some of the cool action, the people that I meet, and everything that we got going on there. Keep it right here on the Proper Royals channel, and until next time, see ya!